Hi everyone, welcome back to another video. Right, this is the Charlie's Nail Art collab for this week. Uh, the theme is warm and cosy. Uh, I'm just showing here what I'm using Little Toto and uh, Glam DC from Madam Glam. Uh, I did pull out another one, which was a brunette uh, from Gel Bottle, but I didn't use that in the end anyway. Um, so here we go. Uh, I will do two coats. Uh, I do the second one off camera, I think. <clears throat> oh, I feel like I've got a frog in my throat. Um, so yeah, I will speed through a little um, and come back in and out when I need to. Uh, I will go in with some glitter, which is also from Charlie's, and that's called Honeycomb. Uh, honeycomb, where are you? Honeycomb. That's got nice gold and brown tones in it. I also pop a bit of holographic caramel, which is a foil, and some sandstorm as well, which is another foil. On these, you don't really see it that much, um, but it's definitely there. <laughs> Uh, I'm doing an ombre on this nail. I do the second one off camera as well, I think. These really looked nice ombre together. I was very impressed. And I like Little Toto because it's got a little shimmer in it. So, yeah, it was it was lovely. Um, nice, warm, warm tones in, in these colours, which is where I got the, you know, the, I don't know what I'm talking about. Anyway, shut up Kerry, move on. We're going to go in with some bling as well on these nails. Um, they are... I can't remember what they are. I think they were from... I think they were from Crystal Parade. Um, yeah. Or Blue Street Crystals, maybe. I can't remember. I've had them a while. Um, but yeah, it looked nice on, on with the colours together. Nice golden, briny tones. Um, oh, I do do the second coat off, on camera. Um, yeah, okay. thought I did it off camera, but I've done this a while ago. Um, so please forgive me for not remembering what I did. Um, oh, I'm just getting off a of hair. So on this now I'm doing a full coat of DC, Glam DC. Um, I only do one coat because we're going to do full glitter and the foils on this nail as well. Um, yeah, so Sandstorm, which is like a marble. Again, you don't see it. Um, yeah, in the end I just went in with the full glitter so you didn't really see it that much and the same with this one as well just to give the colours underneath something a little different so I'm going in with the sparkle supplies foil glue all over and that will have a 60 second cure So with this, I just patted it um, into the foil. I didn't want full coverage or anything. It was just a bit of background. And the same with this holographic caramel. Um, just wanted it to kind of peep through the glitter because although I'm going all over the nail, it's not a full coverage of glitter. So that was that. And I do exactly the same with this one as well. Well, 
the holographic caramel colour is beautiful by the way the camera just doesn't do it any justice it's, it is super super nice just gives you that nice warm glow which is uh yeah part of the theme so once they have been done i don't know what i'm doing oh adding a bit more <laughs> I think I go in, I will go in my base coat. I do go in with the base coat and then I'll apply the glitter. That last nail lot, I wasn't quite sure what I was doing. Um, but that will be the bling nail anyway. So these were just lovely colours all together, really. Um, yeah, the honeycomb's got that nice brown in there and then you've got that gold popping through which was just that's just so nice lovely lovely glitter um so go and get yourself some by the way um i'll leave my code up on screen if i remember to add it but it's always in the description box below anyway um and that's kerry 10 uh the link to charlie's website is always there so you can click directly to that and place your order um super affordable all of Charlie's um, nail art glitters, foils, just super affordable. So yeah, please do take advantage of that because that 10% discount just gives you even more money off. Right, I went in first with this plastic blooming thing. Um, I don't know what made me pick this up, but I think it's just because it was there. And obviously I didn't want full coverage um, of this glitter I just wanted it dotted dotted around um, but I do change it up on the other nail um, and I just use an old ombre brush just to pick it up because it was just literally taking forever to pick up this with this silly plastic cuticle thing <laughs> which I don't even know why I've got it or where I even got it from it was just there <laughs> it was the first thing I grabbed as you do so when i apply glitter um, especially a chunky glitter i do like to pop smaller chunks around the edges just so they don't um, stick out uh, yeah so nice and easy that will have another base coat as well on top just to encapsulate that um, going in with base coat now and oh okay so i think this one's the glitter fade i did a glitter fade uh, oh i'm just swapping over my brush yeah because it was a glitter fade i wanted to, um to use the brush because most of that glitter i do want in up around that cuticle area and then i can just use the ombre brush to fade that down or up the nail whichever way you're looking at it so I will faff a little bit um, in fact I think with this one um, I pop some of the caramel holographic foil on the top of the glitter um, just to give that a little bit of a glow if you like um, I don't know why I didn't do it first I can't remember but yeah I just I did pop a bit on after but hey I'll shut up and just let you watch this bit This is the one that will have two coats of little toto um and then this will be matte top coated 
this will be the one that will have the bling and here again I'm going over with I think this is the no this is uh, base coat so I'm just base coating over that actually I think I used the base coat just to tap in some of that foil in the end I didn't put any foil gel on there I'll just use the tackiness of the base coat to do that I think it was more just to tie the nails in a little bit and just bring a bit of that hollow over that nail yeah you can definitely definitely see it on camera there it's uh, it was super pretty so just get that warm feeling from it Oh, and I do it twice. Do I do it? Oh, I've put two fingers up. <laughs> so I must have done it twice. I don't know. Oh, okay. So I'm using a uh, Sparkly Rain. This is the matte, a glitter matte top coat from Madame Glam. Um, yeah, it just gives a nice bit more of, um, bit more glitter. A bit more warmth. Oh, I do. There you go. I have done it twice. <laughs> Lovely. Then my blue tack decided to stop sticking. Right. Yeah, that looks good. That's just a bit of a rogue piece of glitter there, which we get rid of. I'm still going at it. <laughs> okay, so this is the shiny top coat from Born Pretty. I'm just literally applying it a little thick over that glitter um, just to ensure that that's encapsulated and flat. Just turn it upside down a little bit and pop that in the lap for six seconds. I was super happy with that ombre. I think I go in with the glitter top yeah this is the the glitter top coat as well the matte glitter top coat from madame glam as well um on this one okay that's what they're looking like so far and let's move on and get this crystal placement in there it's very hard to see that shimmer on um on that nail but it, it is pretty uh, again a uh, super shine top coat from Madame Glam on this one nice generous layer uh, just float that over the nail just encapsulate all those glitter pieces no idea what I was, I was adding a bit of sandstorm to that as well now and <laughs> I don't I don't know why because um, I thought I'd just top coated that one. I don't know. Anyway, these are the glitters. No, they're not. These are the <laughs> these are the crystals. Um, I'm just using a rubber base to apply these today um, because I will just pop them off um, just so I can reuse them. Um, just a shame to waste now I did go in and I was going to do a swoosh and um, I wish I kept it as a swoosh and then I changed my mind and just did a full-on um, straight line of crystals so I will let you watch this guys I will pop back in the end to do the reveal um, I hope you enjoyed this video please do like and subscribe because that would be amazing and I will see you all in the next video don't forget to you take advantage of those discount codes i've got in the description below 
um yeah thank you once again have a good day bye